In this video, we'll be taking a look at three NBA games happening on October 30th, 2022, and providing you with free team picks and total picks for each one of those games. So two picks for each game, four picks in total. Welcome back to Cash Out Sports. Let's dive right into it. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe and to click the bell icon to get notified as soon as these videos get released so that you have more time to plan out your bets as we provide these videos on a daily basis. I can guarantee that you'll have all the important information that you'll need on these three NBA games after fully watching this video. One more thing before we start, if you would like to gain access to our best exclusive betting picks to take your sports betting journey to the next level, then check out our Patreon in the link down below where we offer anywhere from one betting pick a day up to 10 betting picks a day and much more. Now let's get started. Golden State Warriors vs. Detroit Pistons The Warriors continue their stretch across the Eastern Conference on Sunday, October 30th. Golden State faces the Detroit Pistons as the Warriors started the road trip with a loss to the Hornets. The Pistons have been brutal with only one win in their opening six games. The Warriors are 3-7 against the spread in their last 10 road games and 4-1 against the spread in their last five games playing on zero days rest. The Pistons are 0-4 against the spread in their last four games playing on one day's rest and 1-4 against the spread in their last five games overall. The over is 5-0 in Warriors' last five overall. The over is 9-1 in Pistons last 10 overall. The Warriors are 4-0 against the spread in the last four meetings. The defending NBA champs are in town as they face the Pistons on Sunday night. Their team that is led by Curry, Thompson and Draymond Green will be able to play their best basketball against the struggling defense of the Pistons. Detroit is allowing 50% to be made from the across the league and they gave up 56% from field goal range to Atlanta. Curry should feast against the Pistons. He scored 18 points against Detroit last year. He will score more at ease against a weak defense. The Warriors are in 2-3 against the spread this year. Detroit is 2-4 against the spread. The Warriors have yet to win consecutive games this season as Curry has been the only consistent performer so far. While the Pistons are one of the coldest teams in the league and it doesn't look like their losing streak is going to end anytime soon, at least not in this game. The Warriors are clearly the better team. They are 4-0 against the spread in the last four meetings overall and they need this win to get their season back on track after a tough loss last night. So the Golden State Warriors to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. The Warriors play at the fastest tempo in the league and the Pistons struggle to get stops. Two weak defenses go head-to-head -head on Sunday as the Pistons give up an average of 123 points per game this season. The Warriors are allowing the fourth most points per game this season with 121 points per game. The over is 5-0 in the Warriors' last five games. The over is 5-0 in Pistons' last five home games. Over the projected total is our full game total pick. Minnesota Timberwolves vs. San Antonio Spurs The Minnesota Timberwolves have been playing well to begin their season as they are currently fifth in the Western Conference with a 4-2 record so far. They are coming off of a 111-102 home victory over the Los Angeles Lakers on Thursday. Shooting guard Anthony Edwards led the team with 29 points on three of eight three-point attempts. The Phoenix Suns have been playing well this season inside of the Footprint Center on Thursday night as they are third in the Western Conference with a 3-1 record. They are riding a two-game winning streak after defeating the Golden State Warriors on Tuesday by a final score of 134 to 105. Shooting guard Devin Booker led the game with 34 points in that game. Looking at the betting trends, the Timberwolves are 12 to 3 against the spread in their last 15 Sunday games and 3 to 8 against the spread in their last 11 games following a win. The Spurs are 9 to 1 against the spread in their last 10 games against a team with a winning record, 5 to 1 against the spread in their last 6 home games and 14 to 3 against the spread in their last 17 games overall. Head to head, the over is 9 to 3 in the last 12 meetings in San Antonio and the Timberwolves are 8-2 against the spread in the last 10 meetings overall. The Minnesota Timberwolves need to take advantage of games like this if they're going to fulfill expectations, but their outside shooting has been an issue up to this point, and it makes it tough for them to pull away. The San Antonio Spurs are a mess defensively, but they've been lighting up on the offensive side, and they've been money-making machines dating back to the end of last season. These two teams met just a few nights ago, and it was the Timberwolves who won by 134-122 to thanks to big nights from town. Edwards, Noel, and McDaniels, so the Spurs will have revenge on their mind now that they're back at home. The Spurs were supposed to be rebuilding this season, but they've hit the ground running and I think they can pull off another upset. In this spot, the Spurs have the feel of a fun bad team that loses a lot but can score just enough to cash tickets. 
so the San Antonio Spurs to cover the spread as underdogs is our full game side pick. These two teams have been two of the fastest teams in terms of pace throughout the season as Minnesota is fourth in the NBA with 103.2 possessions per 48 minutes while San Antonio is right ahead of them at third in the sport with 103.6 possessions per 48 minutes. A big way to get open looks is to find the open man and San Antonio is leading the sport with a 72.3 assist percentage while Minnesota is 15th with a 59.2 assist percentage. Both teams have some skilled scorers and the defense specifically by San Antonio Antonio is not good. The over has hit in nine of their previous 12 games between one another inside of this arena. Over the projected total is our full game total pick. Orlando Magic vs. Dallas Mavericks The Orlando Magic traveled to Texas on Sunday to take on the Dallas Mavericks. The Young Magic team has started the season 1-5 after losing their first five games before trouncing the Hornets at home. The Mavericks, fresh off of last season's Western Conference Finals appearance, have fallen to 2-3 this year following an overtime loss to Oklahoma City on Saturday night. Looking at the betting trends, the Magic are 0-6 against the spread in their last six road games and 6-13 against the spread in their last last 19 games overall. The Mavericks are 20-7 against the spread in their last 27 home games and 4-1 against the spread in their last 5 games against a team with a losing record. Head-to-head, -head, the over is 5-2 in the last 7 meetings overall and the Magic are 1-6 against the spread in the last 7 meetings in Dallas. The Dallas Mavericks are in a tricky spot after playing last night and losing to Oklahoma City. The Mavs have played 2 overtime games since Thursday, so there could certainly be some tired legs from this team. With all that said, the Orlando Orlando Magic are a young, competitive bunch, but they have serious issues scoring the basketball. That's not what you want to see when going up against an explosive Mavericks team. The Magic were suffering through an ugly slide before upsetting the Hornets in a big win on Friday, while the Mavericks have yet to find their groove despite Doncic playing like he's in midseason form. The Magic are 1-6 against the spread in the last seven meetings in Dallas, and I believe that trend continues here as the Mavericks really need a solid win here to gain some confidence and get back on track. This game may not be pretty, but the Mavs should win by a decent margin. So the Dallas Mavericks to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. The Magic are 16th in points against and are an abysmal 29th in assist, turnover ratio and will likely be without point guard Cole Anthony in this matchup. Dallas went to the over in the second game of their first back-to-back -back this year and are 5-0 to zero to the over in the second game of their last five back-to-backs. Dallas is also 5-1 to one to the over in their last six games against teams with a losing record. Dallas will certainly exploit the Magic's 29th-ranked defense against the 3PT field goal. Over the projected total is our full game total pick. That's all for now, so if you have any other games you would like reviewed, then leave a comment down below with the game you would like analyze. Subscribe to our channel, leave a like on this video, and we'll get to it as soon as we possibly can. We would also love to hear your opinion on the picks presented to you in this video, whether you agree or disagree with them, so leave a comment down below and do let us know.